Hi, fed anything increase both by component and by distance fade systems. How does they work? By component, anything between the camera and the player character will be faded. We placed a fade this mesh component on this wagon. Let's play to see the resulting game. When you use the fade component method, you can customize the capsule size, its radius, and its location from camera or from character. Let's see the second method, fade by distance. In this situation, we choose to fade by distance to the camera. We will only fade the leaves of this tree. The trunk will not fade, but you can fade it also if you want. The leaves will start to fade from a start point to an end point at distance from the camera. Here are the two points I chose. Now, if I move the player character under the tree, when the camera is among the leaves, this player will appear clearly. Here you can see the resulting game. You can see the leaves are not faded. And now, they fade gradually, depending on their distance to the camera. The foreground is almost transparent while the background is not faded. And this on a unique static mesh. This means, depending on the two-point distance you choose, you can fade only a part of a static or a skeletal mesh while the other part is still visible. This technique eliminates also every camera clipping problems with your elements. Oh. Mm -hmm.